Is this the bottom in BTC and outs now? Um, I don't think it's the bottom. I don't think we, we can officially say that, but what's your take on this, Bill? Yeah, I mean, you got to have Bitcoin above 5,700, right? A period. You know, I, I've got a big inflection point in some of my other work coming up, like in the next four or five days. But, you know, Bitcoin has to build a base. Crypto has to build a base the way it did before it took off in February of 2019, right? So, you know, you can't, you, 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 don't, you don't even know what's going to happen with stocks, right? I mean, what happens if the Fed prints all this money and stocks just go, who cares? And everyone just panics, right? So, you know, we can't, you have to just look at levels. This is why we're saying, look at the levels and look at your plan and says, if Bitcoin goes to this point, that's my personal bottom. Like, where is the personal bottom for you? Right. Yeah, I mean, so, and I think trying to predict the bottom isn't really a good strategy because nobody knows the bottom. Right, but, bottom but, fishing is an expensive sport. Yeah, very expensive. I mean, probability is, doesn't matter how smart you are, probability is you can't predict the bottom. And by the time we all know it's the bottom, it's too late to, to really a, go it, in and buy. Over. Right, so I think as opposed to trying to predict the bottom, just, as Bill said, just kind of know what price points you're ready to deploy capital and, and, and buy, right? So I think kind of dollar cost averaging over a particular period or, 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 or over a particular price points that you have in target as it kind of dips below. So you kind of want to, as opposed to predicting the, the exact price, you almost want to kind of gr uh, grab it almost in a, in a cup and handle fashion, if that makes sense. Right, so you kind of you are basically buying it in, in a U shaped fashion, right? Because people think that it's gonna happen like as a as a V, where it goes down like and bounces back up. But I think a good strategy is to kind of gradually buy via a smooth line. If that makes sense. 